Ahead of 9-11 this week, people are starting to hold remembrances to honor those who gave their lives on 9-11. That includes the 8th annual Stephen Stiller Tunnel to Towers 5K. <laughs> Is held around the country. The 5K is in honor of a fallen firefighter, Stephen Stiller, who ran three miles to the Twin Towers, carrying 60 pounds of gear after hearing about the first plane crash. He was off duty that day when he ran to help. Leaders say this event keeps his memory alive for generations to come. John Ryan says he will never forget the day the clock stopped 23 years ago. I spent 34 years in the fire service, um, not FDNY, but, but in the fire service. And I am a native New Yorker. So I have a, a connection in my heart that, that, you know, um, that, that was my city and we were under attack and those were my brothers and they gave the ultimate sacrifice. 23 years later, through the Tunnel to Tower 5K, Ryan says he's keeping a promise to never forget what it took for America to come together as one. We all get that. Um, the, the folks that were alive and lived through the tragedy and the follow on um, unification of the American spirit. We, we all have that now built into our DNA, but my grandkids don't. You know, um, some of the students here at Augusta University don't. And so it's imperative and, and um, incumbent upon us as those that do to make sure that we reach back down to the generations coming up and help them to understand what this is all about. That's why they suit up to walk or run, remembering the 343 firefighters who gave it all. You know, we're firefighters and to be in the memory of our brothers and sisters, we know the sacrifice that we may be have to ask to give one day. So I mean, just to, to give something back as best we can. Yeah, just kind of run, go through it, kind of memorialize them and feel just 1% of what they probably felt that day and what they went through. And to continue the mission, to teach the next generation all about the day, the entire world changed. What happened that day was a tragedy unlike any other. I mean, and the people that died that gave their lives, not only the 343, but the police officers, just the people in the towers and the planes, you know, and then everyone stepped up. I think everyone needs to remember what that was like. I was super young when 9-11 happened. My mom to this day tells stories of running to pick up my sister and I from daycare as my family sat around their TV in disbelief of what was happening to our country. A thank you will never be enough to the men and women who gave it all to save so many. And we know so many of you love to give back and honor our heroes. So if you missed out on this event today, don't worry. There'll be many more events going on later this week and we'll have a list for you updated on our website at WRDW.com.